here we go. So we're going to kick off with uh, some four birthday messages. Some of them are quite long, which we absolutely loved reading. Uh, so <laughs> we might need to condense them as we get closer to the end of that 40 minutes. But we've got some quick <laughs> ones to start. So Kaos is going to kick off, followed by Dave, followed by Dawn, followed by me. So off you go, Kaos. What you got? Hang on, I need to unmute myself. Um, right. This one's from Jane Andrews. It says, thank you so much to everyone at Make Movement Your Mission for keeping these 30 days. Just before my lockdown birthday in 2019, going every day for nearly two years. And she's calling us totally amazing. Thanks, Jane. Thank you, Jane. Uh, Dave, go. Uh, this is from uh, Sue Tilly. So hi, to, uh, hi Sue. Uh, it says, motivating, evidenced, and it works for me. I have so enjoyed the banter too while getting moving again. Make moving your mission and losing some weight through Slimming World has made a significant positive difference to me. My thanks to the three of you for your selfless and tireless dedication to make this movement your mission. It's been an amazing success. Thank you, Sue. Oh, thank you, Sue. Uh, DS, you're on. I've got a message from Killalo, Joy yeah. Coote, uh, who said she couldn't join us all the time recently because she's had a few problems with a sore shoulder. Um, so she couldn't do a shirt off or a Bex hug for a bit. Um, but she still does MYM every day, mobilises every morning, does a little crowbar every now and then, got good habits going there. Um, from the start, it made her aware of her weaknesses and asymmetries, but she's worked on them. She joins sessions as regularly as she can, um, she'd like to make it a good habit again because she noticed the difference when she wasn't. She wants to thank everybody on the call and everybody else on Make Movement Your Mission because the regular names posting became friends and one found they're following their activities when they were missing wondering about you all. So keep up the good work from Joy. Thank you, Joy. Uh, it's thank me. You, Joy. <clears throat> Uh, this is Mrs. Hillier, who isn't on the call. She sends her a, pol a polls from uh, Mrs. Hillier, or dealing with a G, uh, uh, J, as we uh, affectionately now know her. Uh, and I understand that uh, Mr. Hillier wrote this little ditty for us. <clears throat> it is said good things come in threes. The three <laughs> wise men, the three musketeers, the three stooges. Don't know what she means by that. Uh, <laughs> even the three of the four Talbot. Posse. I think that bit's meant to rhyme. Uh, three M's, not the this is a company in, in Wales, by the way. Three M's, not the company, but make movement your mission with the three amigos, Bex, Kaos, and Dave, who, like good medicines, are taken three times daily <laughs> with crowbars <laughs> and snack to improve health and well-being. That's from Gillian. Uh, Mrs. Hillier, exclamation mark, because I do tend to feel a bit formal when I speak to Mrs. Hillier. <laughs> <clears throat> That's our first four, first four messages. Thank you, folks. Uh, D, uh, Dawn, we're on here now for uh, like a, a five minute. It says Bex and DS have a natter about how it all came about. Um, <laughs> Dawn, are you there? Yeah, I seem to remember you messaging me at some ungodly hour. Yeah. Um, just before night or something saying we need to do something and I went yes we do what <laughs> well, I was chatting I was chatting with Bob Bob's on the call so Bob and I were having a call and we were trying to get uh, Dawn involved but uh, she wasn't replying Dawn and uh, Bob and I were and we were like where's Dawn where's Dawn there's some something something something's got to happen here uh, and then I think your message is to say what do you want I was on the phone talking to someone else and then you read the thread didn't you and you went oh my goodness yes what a great idea very simply, it's very simple, really. I think I think all the best things are really quite simple. Um, prior to March of that year, uh, we at LLT put out our first active calendar, 2019, that would have been, I think. Um, so the, the first logical thing seemed to do was to, to make that available as a, as a free downloadable PDF. Uh, so we plan to put that out on our website. And then I thought, well, <clears throat> we haven't got a lot to do, really. We're all kind of stuck indoors a bit. So uh, why, <laughs> don't, why don't I just jump on three times a day or, or make a Facebook group and just take people through these movements from the active calendar? Uh, and I remember thinking that I was sat in the lounge with mum and dad because I was in lockdown here with mum and dad. The other thing that was going through my head was, don't tell me mum is. 
was um, I thought, oh my goodness, I'm locked down here with mum and dad. What am I going to do with myself? <laughs> Uh, and that was that we created the the facebook group we watched people join we did the we put out the video didn't we from uh, from the top of the washing machine in the conservatory and uh the rest as they say is history and after that first two weeks i think Dawn, wasn't it when you all started to message us and email us <clears throat> we kind of went oh my goodness oh my goodness what have we done now now we've started, we can't stop. It was a bit like that, that mastermind catchphrase. I've, I've started, so I've finished, but actually we can't. Yeah, it was only meant to be 30 days because that's what we thought the lockdown was going to be for. Um, and the plan really was just to support all the instructors we've trained because they had nowhere to send anybody or to, to engage people. Um, but yeah, it's changed lives, hasn't it? It's been fabulous. It's been uh, incredible. So that, that is why we're still here about to celebrate our, our, our second birthday. Um, without anyway that's enough about me let's talk about you uh more more messages chaos another one from you please i think says the script yeah and and one thing on the end of that bex is whenever you get a phone call off bex and she goes chaos got an idea got an idea <laughs> <laughs> you go <laughs> another fine mess you'll get me into rebecca <laughs> uh yes no Story. this um this Different. next message is from one of our movement snackers called Bridget that actually lives about two miles away from me. Um, and this is a fab little message. She said, I joined in late 2021 after being diagnosed as pre-diabetic. At the time, she felt rather sedentary and her lifestyle and quite depressed. Uh, the group has given me routine and a sense of belonging. The five minute chat at the start is really motivating and she loves finding out what others are doing as well. Um, she says, I pop in for the chat at 8 a.m. or noon, but don't do the actual movements until she's digested her breakfast and her lunch. Her back aches have disappeared, except when she carries too much shopping. <laughs> and her posture has improved and she fits in the neck and shoulder movements if she's been sitting for too long. And she finishes off with saying, Bex, Kelsey and Dave are insp inspirational, always cheering us on, whatever their own personal battles uh, with knees. I think she's referring think to my I think that's you there, mate, yes. <laughs> with knees, COVID, Dave had COVID not long ago, didn't you, David? Intrusive, yeah. funny families. I think that might be mine as well. Yeah. And pets. <laughs> and uh, she finds the pre-messages, music, pictures and stuff really inspiring. And she can't begin to tell us what a difference she's made, we've made to her life. Brilliant. Amazing. Thank you, uh, Bridget. Uh, Thank you, Bridget. Dave, you're up. Uh, this is from uh, 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 George, Super G. Hi, George. How are you? And uh, we've got three words simply happy two years from George. Thank you, George. We love George. He's a man of many words, is George. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Super G. <laughs> it's good to have you with us for the two years, George. <laughs> uh, Sandra, Sandra, are you there? Sandra has uh, said that she's more than happy to read her message. So, uh, Sandra, <laughs> are you off mute? You're on. I think I think you can hear me. Can you? Yes, go for it. Yes, you can go. hear me. Well, I, I kept it short and sweet because um, there's a lot I could say about this wonderful group. Um, my three words are movement friendship and laughter. That's what I've got out of it. Um, I'm so grateful for finding Make Movement Your Mission through my physio, who I was under at the time, because um, I was going through a very bad time. Um, Make Movement Your Mission has improved my mobility in a big way. Um, it's helped me with strength. And absolutely mentally it's helped me because everything that happened to me was in lockdown and I felt very alone. But this little group has really and truly helped me. Um, I just want to say that you've changed my life for the better. And it's lovely seeing you all on here now. Just to say happy birthday and thank you so much for all you've done for me. <laughs> Big Bex hug. 
Uh, thank you. Right, so I'm much. Got now. I've got tears. <laughs> <laughs> Started. Started uh, me off. I've got one from uh, Carolyn Galloway. It says she's been snacking since last May and ever so grateful for the dedication of the three of you, faithfully delivering the snacks every single day, no matter how busy you are. The small, easy to do exercises have made such a difference to me as their effects accumulate, making my movement easier and safer. And for the first time, I found exercise to be fun. No, thank I can't you. believe it. Thank you, and Kelsey and Dave. <laughs> oh, amazing. Thank you, um, Carolyn. Say the exercise word. <gasps> yeah, we'll let, we'll let that go. We'll let, we'll let that one go. <laughs> yeah. Right, uh, on the squits next, uh, Kel, Kels and Dave, uh, have a bit of a nutter, please. Uh, how did your first snack feel? As Cal said that they, they knew it was coming. They were, they were waiting <laughs> for the call, for sure. Uh, tell us how... How did your first movement snack feel? What well, does it mean we to simply you now? couldn't. We simply couldn't leave you to it, could we? We had to have a piece. Thank you. Um, and I must say, I did hold off slightly to think, see if any other LLT staff members wanted to get stuck in there, but they didn't. So I was like, oh, I'll, that'll be me then. <laughs> <laughs> Dave, <laughs> I'll, I'll do this. Um, but Dave, do you remember the practices on the secret group i do i do <laughs> fond, uh, fondness uh, i remember um my first session and um needing to to pay a visit immediately beforehand and i remember bits of paper pinned on the wall in front of the me behind the camera uh, reminding me to smile and to <laughs> try and not be serious um, and to, to say certain words, um, I don't think and I'm not to say this. certain words, not to say certain words like the E word, yeah, yeah, um, and um, a bit like Kelsey, really. Uh, thought can't leave Bex to do this on her own, she's she's done 30 days and been going, it's it's a hard old slog, um, and I think a bit like. A bit like yourself, uh, Bex, when you said, I was thinking, you know, it's locked down at home. I'm, I'm a self-employed person 90% uh, of the time. Uh, and where I wasn't self-employed was shut down as well. So I literally was doing nothing. I was at home uh, all the time and climbing the walls. So um, it was it was great to be able to offer and say, you know, I'd, I'd love to get involved. And I, I think I probably I'm sure you'd agree, Kelsey. I've loved every minute of it. Yeah, absolutely. And yeah. do you know what I did quite enjoy doing as well? And this is going to sound rather self-centred and like, like I love myself, but, that, you know, that's not me. But I did really <laughs> enjoy watching myself back. I thought, I thought, I like this girl. <laughs> I can't do funny. that. I can't do that. <laughs> I, I, I cringe as I'm... Um... As I'm editing the post to put the title in it, and it start, I start talking in the background, and I think, no, shut up, shut up. <laughs> yeah, my, so. my, husband's, my husband's looked at me and goes, are you watching yourself again? <laughs> <laughs> I, I particularly loved our egg. You're, that's the beauty of you three you're all slightly different in terms of personalities <laughs> and, that, and that's what's so lovely is that we, everybody feels like they're they've got a different bit of you that they that they love going there love doing their snack with i particularly loved our uh, our music phase Kels. I, I, um, <coughs> what was it did... summer of 69 yeah that's it. Yes. Uh... <laughs> do you remember my vogue I do. <laughs> I do. <laughs> right, quick before they burst into song. Um, right, <laughs> swift, swiftly moving on. We got loads more messages to read. I've got, I've got. Thank you, Dave and Cal. So, um, and I think everyone knows it, it. The whole thing has just been a complete, a complete joy from beginning to to not end. Uh, right, let's carry on. I've got another message here, and um, this is from, this is from the Bolton team. Uh, uh, just, uh, I've had. Yeah, loads. Anyway, let me just read this. Little did we know what impact you were going to have on us when you burst into our lives three times a day on the 23rd of March. You arrived just at the right time for us as we finally discovered something that worked for our situation and that over the months that has brought us a quality of life we never thought we could have. 
all down to the expertise, information, advice, movement, chatter, laughter of such a dedicated team. Progress has been made, routines established and knowledge gained, as well as lots of social and mental rewards. We would like to say congratulations. Thank you and happy birthday to all at the Make Movement Your Mission team and all of our fellow snackers who for two whole years, 24 months of happy snacking. To celebrate, couldn't forget the cushions. Now there are two. Two years, two cushions, photo attached. Uh, you will see this photo. I'm going to use it as our cover on Wednesday when our, when our birthday actually comes. But uh, Vivian has actually, I don't know if you remember the first cushion she made. She's, she's made a, a partner cushion. We've got a blue one and a yellow one with uh, MMYM on it. So uh, thank you, Vivian and Paul, um, Aka, the Bolton team. Kaus, you're on. Thank you. Um, this next message is uh, from Odile. Um, and, and I'm not going to read it in a, in a cute little French accent, which is what Odile, it, Odile's French. She's, she's fabulous. Um, mm -hmm. And she says, thanks to little and often Make Movement Your Mission Movement Snacks most days for the last two years. Brackets. This is bamboozling. I have developed new habits of movement. Uh, of moving, which have markedly improved my flexibility and strength for daily life. I'm full of gratitude uh, for the absolutely dedicated Make Move Your Mission guides, mm -hmm. Bex, Kelsey, Dave, and their families who bear with us. Um, the LLT's great evidence-based work behind the scenes, you allow this all to happen graciously on social media on top of it all. And she's put, thank you, with lots of yous at the end. Regards, Odile. Thank you. Oh, she would, she did hope to be with us today, but uh, uh, other things cropped up. Okay, next one now. Uh, uh, Rebecca, you're here on the call. Uh, this this was an immense one for me as, as a fellow exercise professional. I'm gonna I'm gonna skip the first half because it is quite long. Uh, I'm gonna pick it up as uh, pretty much as as Dave expressed. You know, lots lots of instructors were were now at home had were delivering groups working with older people and would have had immense immense relation professional relationships with lots and lots of people that they were probably supporting for many many years so for for people like us it was just it's just awful to, to think and wonder what on earth were happening to to, to all our, our wonderful colleagues and friends anyway i'll pick this up uh, rebecca if i may at the point that you say as you can imagine i was deflated deflating slowly <clears throat> Watching you guys deliver made me feel that there was someone doing something positive, uh, made me smile. Lockdown affected me hugely as I was unable to help the approximately uh, the 50 plus people uh, I was seeing pre-COVID. I had to ring people, which was great at first, but as the weeks passed by uh, and you were hearing of people who, who had uh, become unwell and their mobility was suffered, uh, it was hard work. Um, it's hard work to improve for slipping. No one rang me to see how I was doing. Three kids at home, sharing a laptop, husband working 37 hours uh, and me at 26. You kept me sane. Together with unpaid work, uh, with the organisation she was working with, you kept me uh, remaining positive uh, and knowing that's what I do. We is life changing and we can have a huge positive uh, implication to people's lives. Um, you asked me how important it was, uh, and it really did make a difference to how I felt. Uh, I like this bit, Rebecca, and you know, don't uh, don't step away from the phone uh, too far. I even felt like messaging you to say if any of you wanted a day off, I would happily step in. It's also been a good CPD and reminder of some things due to many years lone working. It's good to see others regularly doing something similar. Thanks, Bex, and everyone at Later Life Training. You literally have been a lifeline. Thank you, Rebecca. Dave, you're on. Uh, right, so I've got a message here from Ken Green. Uh, it says, congratulations on the second anniversary of Movement Snacks. Absolutely great that you've all worked so hard to keep us moving. Sincere thanks to all involved in making it such a success. Keep up the great work. Uh, you all keep me motivated. Here's to the next two years, Ken. Oh my goodness, uh, another two years. Go Cows. <laughs> 
This is from Francis, who I know is on the call at the moment. So hi, Francis. She's put your morning snacks have definitely improved my posture and developed my awareness of balance. They've become an uplifting and integral start to my day. I rarely manage to log into the later snacks because I'm often busy. Um, and she thanks us for all our dedication and keeping the routine ourselves um, through everything that goes on in our lives and our works as well. Um, and she mentions our humour. <laughs> Despite whatever, um, we have remarkably survived any, any glitches that we've, um, we've had. And we've had a few, haven't we? There have been a few glitches along the road. But thanks for bearing with us on that one, everyone, because it's never our fault. It's Facebook. <laughs> Except, do you remember when I had food poisoning? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, I was no. in my pyjamas at that point, oh, and no. I was like, oh, Bex, <laughs> I I'm jumping on. I just, I, managed to, being... I just managed to say, good morning, everyone. Um, okay, and in that moment, I thought, I'm not going to make it through the next minute, let alone the next 20. If I don't make it through, and then I said, I can't make it through, and I disappeared. And within a minute, Kels was there. <laughs> I remember Kels being bitten alive by midges. Ah, in the yes. Scottish it was a moving that was, snack that was doing this, wasn't it? <laughs> <laughs> and she went, that's not the moves. It's not the moves. <laughs> I forgot that one. Right, hang on a minute. Where are we? Uh, it's yes. me, it's me next. Yep. Yeah. I, I don't know who this is from, though, but It's uh, Susanna. Ah, cool, Susanna. She's on the call. So you're on the call. Oh, I'll try. I'll, yep. I'm, I'm not going to summarise it because it's, it's brilliant. Yeah. So do you think Make Moving Your Own Mission is a naughty toddler now? It's the naughty twos. Uh, I can't compress all what's happened in the way of movement to my physical and mental health as a result of joining in with Make Moving Your Mission over two years into three sentences, just not possible. There's so much, and I'm so much better in mind and body than I was in 2020. I'd almost given up hope then. I looked back at my previous emails and found I'd written something that will do. It is one sentence. I'm very grateful to you and the team for helping me stand up straight for the first time in 50 years. I continue to stand up straight. I can now squat right down, stand on each leg for a minute, reach round to do up my bra, touch my toes, and generally move more fluidly. And I feel reassured and competent and grounded as a result. And what's more, I've gained much more understanding of how the mind and body connect, of what I need to do to stay healthy and flexible. And more importantly, it is preferable to do that than do nothing. I now do about an hour of flexibility exercises a day, a sort of make movement your mission sandwich. My specific exercises are the filling and the top half and the bottom half are make movement your mission. They're the bread slices. I now meditate, a new addition, which has made a massive improvement to my mental stability. And I try to do three cardio and strength activities per week. Can't keep up with you, Susan. <laughs> an unbelievable expansion of activity. And what's more, I enjoy it. But if I took away Make Movement Your Mission from this mix, I feel a real loss. You and the team's joy, consistency, reliability and kindliness have helped not only with the physical moves, but also mental moving too. I'm so glad to belong to Make Movement Your Mission, although I do mainly seem to be on catch up now. I do love the lives. Super work. And oh, my goodness, I, I, I've said many times, you know, you can you can take the horse to the water and, that, and that's all we do really uh but the, the congratulations and the immense work just just comes to, to to every single one of you who have uh who have embraced the the benefits of additional moving minutes incredible stuff this is uh from uh one of the patabot posse uh jillian with a g happy birthday mmym and snack mates what an amazing two years it's been a huge thank you to an amazing team for your commitment dedication inspiration and enthusiasm regular snacking has motivated uh, motivated me and given me a better awareness and appreciation of the benefits of benefits of movement the fun and interaction between us all has been wonderful look forward to many future snacks thanks jill thank you jill thank i've got one from uh, rosalie hollis here who says thank you so much bex kelsey and dave for your time dedication and positive encouragement you inspire, inspired me to move and I walk further than I ever thought possible. At nearly 75, I'm a very grateful movement snacker. Thank you again and enjoy your birthday, Sally. Thank you. Well done, Rosalie. 
Thank you very it's much. Me. Yes. It's me, isn't it's it? You. Uh, yeah. This one is from Gail Martin Jones, who's on Facebook. She's a Von Smart exercise leader from Canada. On the call. And she says, hello. <laughs> hello to the whole team. Sending blessings and thanks to all of you from Canada. As an exercise leader with seniors, I'm always looking for ideas to get us moving. After I accomplish my goal, I'm still loving your dedication and sincerity to all of us. Throughout this pandemic and many lockdowns here in Canada, I knew I could, three times a day, have an exercise snack with you prior to getting my own seniors motivated to move it or lose it. Many, many thanks to each and every one of you, whether you're a leader or a participant who engages others. We thank you. Wishing you a very happy birthday as we all move forward to a new world. Love, hugs and thanks. Thank you, Gail. Thank you. I know you're on the call as well. Thank you. Mm. We got two in from Canada. Oh, who let them in? Right. This one is from uh, Tracy Ace. She's not on this call. She's uh, actually a friend of my mom's from Rockwire and has become a friend of mine also. Hi, Bex and the amazing team. Just wanted to say a massive congratulations to Bex, Kaos and Dave on reaching two years strong of Movement Snacks. I'm sorry I haven't been able to join you all as much as I would like, but my gorgeous puppy Olaf is keeping me a very active 24-7. However, when I have joined you, I've always been made to feel welcome and feel better for completing each movement snack. Keep up your hard work, um, you super team. Kindest wishes, Trace, the Ace and Ola. I've got one here that comes from uh, Kim and mom, Jess. Jesse, uh, wow, what an amazing two years of uh, MMYM. Congratulations on this absolutely non-stop achievement. I've been following along, not every single snack, but whenever I could. As a newly qualified PSI at the beginning, I found it really helpful to, a really helpful tool to practice my new knowledge. At the beginning, I found it so very uh, emotional because I wanted to share your tips and movements with my existing clients and classes, which the pandemic had brought to a dramatic stop. Some, however, uh, were able to join in the Make Movement Mission too, like Maddie, who I know has regularly participated. Your words of encouragement, sense of humour, energy is so inspiring as well as motivational. These movement snacks work for all abilities. It's been a happy journey to be part of. Happy birthday. Love from Kim and Mum Jessie. Thank is you. Is Kim on the call? I think Kim's there, is she? Thank you, she. Yes, yes, she is. Hello, Kim. Hello, Kim. Uh, Okie dokes. Uh, Kels? Thanks. Um, Jill and Malcolm. I know Jill and Malcolm are here on the call as well, so it's great to have you here. Um, and they say huge birthday, which is for two years of Make Move Meet Your Mission. It has been a great inspiration for us both and helped us have focus and purpose when lockdowns kept us away from family, friends and normal routines. Uh, when normal routines went out of the window. We are still fans and often pop by for a movement snack. It's a good addiction to have. Jill and Malcolm. Kiss. <laughs> <laughs> Fabulous. Hey, I've got one from a, a lovely Greek friend who's on the call. Hi, Vasiliki. Um, and she says, happy birthday to a dear friend and an amazing leader. Wishes for success and happiness from your Greek friends. Hi, Vasiliki. <laughs> uh, I've got one here from Patricia Franks, who I think is on the call as well. Hi, Patricia. Hi. Uh, happy birthday and well done, um, all of you at Later Life Training. Out of the misery of the pandemic, you have created such a positive life affirming program. You've con contributed to the maintenance of the physical and mental health of so many. Long may it continue. All best wishes, Patricia. Thank you. Thank you, Patricia. Uh, I've got uh, one from part of the collective here. Carol, sorry I won't be with you all. Uh, MMYM has been a lifesaver during COVID and now is my regular daily routine, just like brushing my teeth. Thank you all from Carol Elliott, part of the collective. Another one here from Margaret Hamilton, uh, who's on the call. Uh, her quote just says, love you all every day. You cheerfully make me get up and go. Cheers, Margaret. Thank you, Margaret. Lovely. Go, Kels. So uh, this one is, is a bit of a long one, but it says this email has become an essay. I hope by condensing it, but it's still quite long, you will see my gratitude to the whole team and indeed to fellow stat mates too. At the beginning of lockdown, I was shielding, no family and friends were allowed to visit and I had to stay at home. Community and leisure centres closed. 
I was missing friends and the local exercise group. It was boring exercising at home, but, it, but we were all trying to do our best. Then I was sent a link to Make Movement Your Mission. I turned it, I tuned in and I was instantly hooked. The group has been the best thing that has happened to me during these past two difficult years. The snacks are addictive. I feel I'm with friends, with other groups broadcast 365 days a year. Thank you for your dedication. Bex, Kelsey and Dave, thank you for inviting me into your homes and thanks to Bex's parents for allowing her, their home to become Make Movement Your Mission HQ. Your family's pets have added another dimension to the group. Thanks to Irma, Irma Townley, Kelsey's menagerie. I think I said that right. <laughs> and Dave's Maisie and Lottie. Not forgetting dear old Dobby. Oh, we love Dobby. Where, <laughs> where else would you talk to a picture on the wall? <laughs> <laughs> Bex, Kelsey, Dave, Dawn, Bob and the backstage crew, you are simply the best. My three little words to describe Make Movement Your Mission is motivation, fun, friendship. Love and many thanks, Carol Kent. Oh, thanks, see, Carol. Hey, is she, is she in? Thank you. Uh, I think she is. I need yeah. to s flick through my gallery. My eyes are boggled. Yes, indeed. Right, what have I got here? Uh, Margaret Witt, Bex. Oh no, Miss P. I've got to read this one out. This is me. This is Miss P. My. What can I say about you, Miss Perry? I was I was going to make you read it, but I thought no. You yeah, you're dying inside right now, aren't you? She's going. I'm going to kill you later. Tell me. Right. Uh, Miss P, thank you. A very happy two years to a wonderful team, not only ensuring our health and well-being, but for making us part of a big family. Audio. I love the preamble prior to snacks too. MMYM, supposedly just a short edition, but thanks to LLT, we have longevity. What a pleasure it has been having instruction from a fantastic team. We have our moves, our sways and stretch. Long may it continue for this year and the next, Miss P. Thank you, Miss P. We've got another one here, Margaret Wood. Wow, two years. They've gone so fast. Oh my goodness, haven't they? I, mm, I'm so grateful to this group. That's two years of movement I wouldn't have done. I did start to calculate the hours in those early days. It's just, it's just immense. Uh, when you accrue this type of stuff three times a day, it just becomes phenomenal. The snacks during the lockdown were invaluable for getting me on my feet and they are now such an essential part of my day that I feel guilty if I miss them. They have kept me uh, kept my arthritic joints moving, especially my neck, which I no longer need to take to the chiropractor. My reliance on painkillers has also decreased. The strengthening activities have helped uh, my, with everyday tasks, noticeably getting out of the bath. I've also enjoyed all the banter and camaraderie with the wonderful team and my snack mates and regard them all as friends. Thank you team for keeping us going three times a day, come hell or high water. The water did quite get quite high on times actually. A very happy second birthday, MMY Emma's. Here's to the third. Love to all. Margaret Wood. Kiss. Thank you, Margaret. Um, I, there's been a flurry in today, so I've just I had to add them onto my script to, to save uh, everyone else getting uh, emails from me all day. This is uh, Doris. I'm able to unable to join the Zoom celebration. Suffice to say, as a newbie to the group, I have to say that as well as decrumpling, the banter is very amusing. I enjoy the humour from the instructors. All in all, I look forward to my daily dose. Thank you all, Doris Stewart. Uh, another one here from Chris. This uh, came, it came hurtling in from Penzance today again. I believe that you know that we really value all the hard work that enabled you and the whole team to encourage us all during difficult and sad times to create a joyful community where despite not knowing people, you look forward to being in their company. We feel that we do know you all. Congratulations to your team. You've made us smile always and are a good part of our lives. With best wishes to you and the team. I'm sure the meeting will be great. And that's Chris Rowland. Sorry, two more for me. And then uh, DS is on the finale. 
Uh, no, one more from me. This is from Moira. This came in uh, today also. Make Movement Your Mission has transformed my strength and balance classes. I love the variety of activity-based moves, simple but effective. I feel more confident working with a mixed ability group. My classes are more inclusive and all find a level and benefit that is individual to them. Amazing. Uh, I can't thank the team at Later Life Training enough. You have been inspirational. A big happy birthday from Levin and Fife. Regards, Moira Bell. DS. Over to you. Hi. I have a finale from the lovely Dee who is on the call. Hi Dee. <laughs> um, I'm gonna read out your poem if that's all right, as it's a cracker. So here we go. The, the title is happy birthday and thank you make movement your mission. Being on a sort of cusp has just turned 82, three times a day and all week long, great snacks that all can do. My arthritic knees and tired back ache after walks no longer. Strength and flexibility preserved, keep wobbles from getting stronger. As well as all the actual moves, I'm encouraged to so much more. To walk and hike, use resistance band, these don't feel like a chore. So thank you Bex and Kels and Dave, and Dawn and Robert too. Without you, I might be a blob. Instead, I move with you. I can even do half push-ups, albeit from my knees, and crowbar in so many acts like reaching for my keys. I'll never forget our joyous words, the laughs, the fun, who knew that these two years would bring me, bring to me camaraderie with you. Super poem. Fabulous poem. Hello, <laughs> Stick your head in. Oh! Hello, Mrs. Downley. Wait. I'm allowed to wait. Hi, Lynn. Hello, everyone. Um, Hello. Yeah, my earphones on, so unfortunately, you can't hear my mum. <laughs> no, we can. That's about right. We, no, we can hear her. Can you hear her? Oh, oh yes, yes, we can. can. Oh, 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 hey, nice. Oh, oh, no. Do you want to say something? Not really. No. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's lovely look to see. All. Look, these are all the people I, I kind of talk to quite yeah. a lot. Yes, and I then know. you complain that I don't talk to you. I know. Yeah. That's right. And we can hear it when we're in the other room when we've been shut out. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Don't you love it that Bex's mum's monitoring oh. Bex's internet access? Ah, <laughs> <laughs> you, uh, you can hear my mum. Right. She can't hear you. Why can't I hear them? Because I've got ears. Oh, you should hear what she said about you earlier. <laughs> 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 right, it's time for you to, probably time for you to go. Oh, I've got to go now. Bye. 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 Right. <laughs> right then. Uh, that that's the script done. That's it. So, thank you oh, everybody for Dawn. keeping with us. Oh, um, we missed the, the the key headlines from the evaluation. Oh. Okay. Do a PS. <laughs> Yes, absolutely. I'll tell you why, uh, because it, Zoom have told us they, they've they <laughs> given us a gift of extra time. Oh, thank you, Zoom. Oh. <laughs> thank you, Zoom. It must have known it was our birthday. It must have done. <laughs> so, Go on, thanks cr for crowbar it in, DS, crowbar it in. Hi, Susie. Um, so, yes, this is a quick, uh, quick top-level um, feedback from the evaluation. Thank you for everybody that took part, filled in the survey and did the, uh, the focus group, sorry, the interviews with... Um, Lisa, was it? Yes, it was Lisa. So we have uh, the top headlines. Um, over half of you felt that you were stronger. Um, more than half of you felt better quality of life. 70% felt you were less lonely and less socially isolated. Uh, but the more important is nearly 70% of you felt that you were able to get to do all your activities of daily living more easily. So you were able to go upstairs more easily, et cetera. So really good feedback on that. And interestingly, because everybody's always after us trying to meet physical activity guidelines. And one of those guidelines, as I'm sure you'll remember, when we because we keep mentioning them, <laughs> is twice a week you're supposed to do some strengthening activity. And twice a week, you're supposed to do some balance activity to help your health. Well, the good news is that it's nearly 90% of you meet that. And in fact, you meet that daily. So well mm -hmm. done. Um, it means your general health will also be much better. So it's a fabulous evaluation. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you, everyone. Thank you.
Dawn, I, I suppose just to ask uh, you as the as the academic in the room, how significant is it that we, we we got some research out of this mission? Uh, really, now we do. We've known for some time that if you do something that's moderate, i.e., it makes you slightly out of breath and warmer, that's really good for your health. And that's where all the headlines have been for a long time. And for many people, not many on the, this call, I might add, but for many people, that's just too far away from what they normally do, so they just didn't try. Um, and we were meant to be doing 150 minutes of that a week. What we didn't know was how good the light activity, the movement snack type stuff was. But we've actually now shown some amazing results in relatively short periods of time with relatively small amounts of movement. So it's just a reminder that actually it's always the way, sit less, move more. But more importantly, if we can now get a large grant based on the back of that smaller evaluation, we might have a chance of it rolling out nationally and therefore getting a bit more back for backing from some of the big uh, organizations, et cetera, to, uh, to make sure this keeps going. We'll keep it going anyway, you and I know that. But if we can roll it out bigger so more people can take part, uh, it'd be brilliant. Thank you, dear. My, my dad's just walked through the, the dining room looking very sheepish and, and scared. And he wasn't going to come and say hello. <laughs> no, no, no he, just, he just sidled along there. Uh, <laughs> uh, anyway, folks, uh, that, that concludes uh, the messages that we've received from you. Um, yeah, I think it goes without saying. It's just been an immense an immense joy, the whole, the whole thing, and, and continues uh, to be on, on so, so many levels. Um, so, yes. And, and Big this... love and movement snacking. What was yeah. that, Kels? Oh, <laughs> Big love and movement Big love snacking. And movement snacking. <laughs> um, Keep going, guys. Thank you, thank you so much, everyone. Uh, I've got to make the gravy now. Have you? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stop the recording and... Uh, oh.